Hi, good morning. Uh, video blog number eight. I'm still on track. Um, great day today. I'm looking at doing uh, growth. Uh, I've got a great group, a group of business owners today. Um, at a great venue, Sandy Park. So uh, I'm going to check in a little bit later and give you some feedback as we go. Thanks a lot. Man. So, what can you expect from today? Um, we've had, there's a few of you that have obviously been here before, so we're going to look at reviewing the last 90 days. Um, if you haven't got that in place at the moment, that's not a, not a problem, you can have a look about what it is, you know, if you review 2014, where were you when you started and where do you want to be now? And have you achieved your goals that you set out from last year? Um, obviously, for those of you that this is uh, uh, you know, another growth club you've been to and who I've been working with, then you're going to be in a place where you can review and should have review, review what your last is. Card, I couldn't see it when you showed me last time. So. <laughs> 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 no. So I still can't see that. <laughs> You've seen this. This is the fifth timeline. <laughs> Sports coaching on one side, through to business coaching. On the other. Well, that's the morning over, and we're just having lunch now. And uh, yeah, it's been a really, really great morning so far. I've got the uh, business owner in the room, you know, all enjoying their lunch behind me. Um, but they're thinking differently now. They're uh, starting to get tuned into what their plans are going to look like this afternoon. So um, yeah, it's been a, a good morning so far. And uh, well, what can I say about the venue other than um, it's uh, awesome. So the amount of lead generation that you've got. And those leads are those people that walk past the shop window, have a good look in, and maybe walk into the shop. It's not necessarily a like on a Facebook page. You know, that you're, as you generate those leads, that genuine interest in your business, how do you, how do you measure that at the moment? So, assuming that you're measuring that now, we've got 4,000 leads. Here's the one thing. Does anyone here actually know their conversion rate right now? David. Okay. Helen? Yeah. Stu? Uh, what's Stu? Mark? He's disappeared. Um, not precisely, no. Okay. Bit of a challenge and always quite difficult to nail down the conversion rate. But something that you really want to get focused on. Because the whole point of this is those leads coming in, the only way that they become customers is what? By converting them. So what strategies do you apply to convert customers? So in this instance, we're saying... Uh, we've got a 25% conversion rate. That means of the 4,000 clients that come in, we know our team, us, the systems, processes can convert comfortably 25% of that. Gives us 1,000 customers or 1,000 clients, whichever way you want to look at that. The last one is 100% 100 involvement and inclusion. What do you mean by that? Not, not having people that are excluded. Not having people that, you know, potentially, we talk about these groups having a clicky group and knowing that they don't really work with them. Um, what about, uh, you know, if you've got a, a business that uh, is very technical in one area, have a group of people who are enablers, another group of people that are administrators. What happens? The administrators become clicky, the enablers become clicky, the technicians become highfalutin, uh, and, and you create this whole new environment. Whereas if there's 100% inclusion, you know, you go away, if you do a team day or something of that nature, it's not a case of, right, let's have a race, admin against techies, techies against enablers. It's mix them all up. That's 100% inclusion. What about with uh, hierarchy? How do you... There's a hierarchy within the company where... Uh, Hiya. Oh, uh, well, I conclude my, uh, uh, it's now no longer a video blog, I've now been informed it should be a vlog, uh, and that was courtesy of a good uh, uh, friend and colleague of mine, Chris Lever, who's left me some advice after I asked for it last night, so um, this is working already. But anyway, back to the point, um, Growth Club today, uh, we had a fantastic day at Sandy Park, um, a really good group of business owners who you've just seen uh, on the clips previous to this. And we've really helped to, to, to get them focused and deal with some of the challenges that they've got in their businesses right now uh, and set the, their agendas, set the goals for the next 90 days. 
all with a view of where they're going to be in 12 months and then leading on to their long and medium to medium and long term aspirations. Um, it was full on. We got started at 8.30 this morning with bacon rolls and egg, egg butties uh, and then all the way through till 5 o'clock. So uh, I'm pretty knackered now. I think it's about time for a, a little a, a, a pair of teeth. So I think I'm going to treat myself to a, a nice glass of JD uh, with a bit of, a bit of Coke. Uh, kick back until tomorrow. Have a great evening. Thanks. Bye-bye.